With the Great Salt Lake shrinking day by day, researchers are looking for ways to help save it. Now, one option they're looking into is a bit creative. It's by imitating a rather industrious and aquatic animal. Take a look. The water level at the Great Salt Lake has been affected by a number of different factors. Right now, researchers are working on a way to save the lake by imitating the work of the beavers. Today, we're here to check out the creek and um, take a look at the future locations of some beaver dam analogs for a stream restoration project. Rose Smith, an ecologist with the Sageland Collaborative, is part of a team that's working on a project along Corner Canyon Creek near its confluence with the Jordan River. The hope is for man-made dams called analogs to help slow the stream's flow and make better use of snow melt and spring runoff, thereby restoring the lake and the natural habitat. Bringing natural wood structures back into the stream um, helps to restore some of the, the wetland habitat alongside the creek. Keith Hambrecht, an invasive species coordinator, says the new method will not affect the speed of the stream, but help collect water during periods of runoff. It'll create kind of a pond which provides open water habitat, and then when we have larger floods, it will hopefully allow for um, the river to, to top its banks and flood, which will provide water for riparian habitat that's on the edges of the creek. The Emigration Canyon Sustainability Alliance, in partnership with the U.S. Forest Service, expect to raise the water level of the Great Salt Lake by building analogs. Most conservationists agree that beaver dams can help store water. They also agree that storing water will benefit the watershed as well. However, it remains to be seen if this new technique will have any effect on the Great Salt Lake. Whether or not this actually changes the amount of water that ends up in Great Salt Lake is it's, it's not clear, um, but it can improve the watershed and it can improve the water quality as well. Amy Nay, Fox 13 News, Utah. And Fox 13 News is a part of the Great Salt Lake Collaborative. It is a group of local news outlets, academic groups, and community organizations calling attention to the Great Salt Lake and solutions to save it. You can find out more by visiting the link on your screen.